Hey everybody, it's Chris from Website in 5 Days. Today I'm going to teach you guys how to use a really neat tool for sending screenshots to us for your web design changes, um, but there's probably some other applications that you can find for this tool. So we use this thing called Jing and it's been awesome. It's a free tool that you can use to grab uh, screenshots and then make little edits and then you can send a link off to us or if you have another web designer you can send it over to them and it's really easy to see what you want changed on your website so the first thing you want to do is go to Google and then just type in Jing download and you can see it's right there TechSmith Jing click it and this video will probably give you a tutorial or show you what it is but just click free download and then it'll load up on your computer. You'll have to go through the steps or whatever. It takes like, I don't know, maybe five minutes. But then what will happen is you'll, uh, once it's installed, you'll see that there's this little orange bubble that sits on your browser. And so when you hover over it, you'll see that you have this and this and this and this. And this. So let's go to a website and let's say that I want to make changes. So I'm going to click the little capture button. And now you see that there's like this grid, this orange grid that shows up. Orange grid. And you can basically drag it to wherever you want. And then it'll pop up this. And you want to click Capture Image. Then you have this little box that pops up. So here's the really cool thing. Okay. So you have these little icons over here. Okay. So let's say you have an arrow and you say... Take the arrow and you click on the text and you can say make this button blue or you can say um, grab the arrow like that, change the logo or what else could you do? You can highlight something. And you can actually change the color. Oh, that's not the highlight button. But... You can write text in there. Hello. That's the highlight button. And then you can write text like blur. Let's go back here. Blur this. Out. So there's a number of things that you can do and it just really gives a visual of what changes you want to be made because sometimes what makes sense to you, it's hard for other people to understand that. So once you have got your edits, you go in and you click this little screen share via screencast. Do, 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 do. Perfect. Close. Then you can go to an email, open up a document, say, um, Chris, changes needed for a website. And then, um, actually, you should send this to Aaron. And then you can copy paste. Please see the screen. Cast for changes. Attached our new images and and uh, new logo, and then you just hit send, send it off to the team, and now we can see exactly what it is that you want to do. So it's really really cool, um, very easy, and it's free. And then um, the other thing that I want to mention just before I let you guys go is that you can also do video too. So if you do capture, and you want to do a capture of this. This little capture video button, you can click that and it'll actually take video and you can explain the changes that you want made. So that way you can literally like talk us through, hey guys, move this, change this font, whatever. And then we'll really know what you're talking about. So hopefully this is helpful. I, I highly encourage you to use Jing to send over your requests um, for website changes. It'll make your life a lot easier. It'll make our life a lot easier. Things will get done faster. It'll be way more efficient. 
Um, so definitely use Jing. Uh, feel free to reach out and let us know if you have any questions. Have a great day.